the cabinet has approved eight national high speed road corridor projects of length 936 kilometers at a total cost of 50000 crore to improve the logistics and the efficiency reducing the congestion and enhancing the connectivity across the country the product products will generate 4.42 crores man days of direct and direct employment now the projects also include an eight lane elevated nashik uh, fatal uh, corridor near the pune corridor which will be 30 kilometers in length and will also be developed on build operate transfer at a total capital cost of 7800 uh, over 7800 crores the highway eliminate the existing logistical difficulties which are faced by the commuters and it's going to elevate the congestion around the Pimpri Chindwar region. Now joining me again on this important story is our, uh, uh, is our colleague Brian. Brian now this is indeed a big development. It seems like a, a huge relief for all those who have been facing difficulties on the corridors because these projects are of the uh, national importance which has been now given a great nod by the cabinet eight national high speed projects uh, well, Simran, definitely the union cabinet that is led by Prime Minister Narendra Modi has approved the development of eight axis uh, controlled national highway projects spanning a total of 936 kilometer. Now, these highway projects will cost a whooping 50,655 crore according to the government and this uh, and even the government aims to minimize land acquisition needs and align the projects with existing brownfield sites. Even Union Information Minister Ashwini Vaishnav also stated during a press briefing that the implementation of these projects is expected to generate an estimated 4.42 crore man days of direct and indirect employment. Even the eight projects include the six-lane Agra Gwalior Highway, four-lane uh, Kharagpur Morigram, uh, six-lane Tharar, uh, you know, Disa, Mehsana, Ahmedabad. That is two separate sections. Four lane Pathalgao uh, Gumla section of Raipur Rachi, six lane Kanpur Ring Road, four lane Northern Guwahati Bypass, and improvements to the existing Guwahati Bypass, and the eight lane elevated Nashik Fata Khair uh, corridor near Pune. And even in Ayodhya, also 68 kilometer four lane access control Ayodhya Ring Road will also be developed at a cost of. 3,935 crore and the ring road is expected to reduce congestion on several national highways passing through the city and facilitate the movement of pilgrims visiting the Ram Mandir. It will also, similar important to note, that it will also enhance connectivity for tourists arriving from Lucknow International Airport, Ayodhya Airport and the major railway station in the city. In Guwahati also, a 121-kilometer ring road will also be developed at a cost of 5,000, more than 5,000 crore in three sections, that is a four and access control northern Guwahati bypass, which is which is 56 kilometer widening the existing four lane bypass on NS27 to six lanes, that is 88 kilometers, and the improving uh, existing by, uh, bypass on NH27, that is 58 kilometers, and even a major bridge over the Brahmaputra River will also be a part of the project. And the Guwahati Ring Road will improve connectivity for long distance traffic on National Highway 27 and ease congestion on major highways around Guwahati. Connecting key cities and towns in the region, this uh, development of infrastructure is also fundamental to a country's economic prosperity and quality of life because every uh, rupee that is spent on uh, infrastructure development is uh, estimated to have a multiplier effect on the GDP of 2.5 to 3 times on GDP. For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel, hit the bell icon.